is the one who healed his people. Kept them safe through wind and waves and the battles they would fight and gave them courage in the night. Their story echoes through the ages. A record safe for you and me. That when the mists of darkness rise, and the wars and storms increase We'll know where we can turn for peace And from every page There's a message that rings To sinners and saints And to beggars and kings To come on to Christ From darkness to
He'll provide a way. He'll provide a way. When I feel overcome and all my strength is gone, I think of all the ways He's blessed me. My journey may seem long. Perfect love that's never ending. He will give me, give me all the strength I need in. So whatever He commands, I will go and do. I will stand for truth, though the world may back away. I. In November 1856, pioneers in the Martin Handcart Company were caught by deep snow and cold weather in the mountains of Wyoming. They had already lost many of their members along the way to cold and disease. Starving and fatigued, they met the icy Sweetwater River and felt that they could go no further. Grown men sat on the frozen ground and cried with their wives and children. Then, to their amazement, rescuers appeared on the horizon. Three 18-year-old young men stepped forward and carried nearly every member of the handcart company across the river. The strain was so terrible and the exposure so great that in later years all these young men died from the effects of what they did that day. President Brigham Young cried like a child when he heard what they had done. He later said that act alone would guarantee these young men an everlasting salvation in the celestial kingdom of God, worlds without end. The frozen clouds of winter hid the morning sun At the river's edge our hopes were swept away It seemed we'd reached the bitter end before we had begun And we'd already prayed all that we could pray Then somewhere in the distance, like a precious ray of sun Like angels 
angel sent from heaven They had come One by one He carried us across the water Fighting back the cold Until we reached the other side and Step by step we put our trust in them to guide us Amazed that they would offer Such a willing sacrifice A story that the world may never know How one by one they brought us Fought the river's might And I wondered what would move a soul to give Their mercy for a stranger Was the perfect love of Christ Reaching through devoted hands So that we could live Now the years have passed and I have grown to realize There's one who came to rescue us from every storm of life And one by one he carries us across the water Sheltered in his arms until we reach the other side And step by step we put our trust in him to guide us Amazed that he would offer such a willing sacrifice The greatest love the world will ever know Bring us home One by one He'll bring us Home
the early spring, in a grove of trees, a young man knelt to pray. For the world he knew was a world confused, and he wanted to know the way. Then a pillar of light descended, and the Father and Son appeared. When they spoke his name on that blessed day, the whole world changed. Now there is more light to shine. Storm and more power to gather us home, more faith to lead us closer to Jesus our Lord. All because his gospel was restored in a troubled growing strife if heaven seems so far find a quiet place put the world away and ask with an open heart for the truth only God can give us and the promise of joy and peace and the time to come like the rising sun when the whole world will see that there is more light to shine in the dark and more hope to fill every heart, more truth to know God is there and He will answer our prayers. Why 
should we think to earn a great reward if we now shine the fire gird up your loins fresh courage take our God will never us forsake and soon we'll have this tale to tell all is well Shall dwell. But if our lives are spared again to see the saints, their rest of time, oh, how we'll make this chorus swell. Just where we go And help us to be wise In times when we don't know Let this be our prayer When we lose our to the place 
of the pioneers are not past. There are modern pioneers whose achievements are an inspiration to all of us. In every nation, in every worthy occupation and activity, members of this church face hardships, overcome obstacles, and follow the servants of the Lord Jesus Christ as valiantly as the pioneers of any age. As I followed the prophets and stood against temptation, I've seen how the Lord has blessed me with a greater amount of happiness than I could ever receive from the things of the world. I am a faithful member of the church. I honor my priesthood. Because I'm the first one in my family to accept the gospel, and because I have a testimony of, of the gospel, I am a modern day pioneer. I am a modern day pioneer. We are modern day pioneers. They pay their tithes and offerings. They serve as missionaries or as church service volunteers, or they support others who do so. They sacrifice immediate pleasures to keep commitments that are eternal. They accept callings, and in the service of others, they willingly give their time and sometimes their lives. 
They do as the Savior taught. They deny themselves. They take up their crosses daily. They follow him.